Hey everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Dragon Quest XI. We, now that the place is up and running again, Sniffleheim. Um, let's see if we can do a little bit of exploring. Wonder, hello, hello, you must have sailed a very long way to get here. Uh, before you leave, you must go and see Queen... Uh, yep, we already know that. We're gonna go head to the Queen in a little bit. Um, okay, church... What's going on? The whole place has been frozen for ages, but everyone's gone from their business like nothing happened. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. What are you? Are you here to take a tour of the city and see all of its wonders? Um, yes. The buildings are the envy of all Adria, and so his castle is a jewel of the crown, so to speak, designed in the age of heroes by the legendary uh, Gunnar Biller Borg. It is the must-see for every discerning traveler. Oh, well, that wasn't a whole lot. Ooh. So where's pamphlet called The Rough Planet Guide to Sniffleheim? Nord takes it on the shelf and has a closer look. Oh, okay. Just a little backstory on the area there. Okay. Anything upstairs? Not really seeing a whole lot here. It's a pretty big open building for not having anything in it. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll go take a look in here. Um, nothing. Uh, you say do a puff puff. Um, we haven't done a puff puff in a while. We might as well. Uh, come and meet me at the Harbor Bell tomorrow lunchtime. Okay. We haven't done a puff puff in a while. Go take one of those, and then... I'm hoping with the exploring we'll actually come across some... Excuse me. Hey, there we go. Platinum power. Uh, platinum swords, power swords, and lances. And uh, make a pair of platinum claws. Cool. I'm a bounty hunter and always get my man. They say the dark spawns come to sniff I am. Now I'm here. Well, let's just say that he won't be leaving. Ooh. Oh, what's over here? Anything? Nothing. Oh, hello. Nope. Okay. We got the platinum thing, so that's pretty cool. Oh, hello. I see you back here. Mini metal. We're gonna have to go turn these in in a little bit or whenever we make it back by the school again um yeah we could take a look at the inn or the uh tavern not seeing anything nothing yet 24 okay nothing other than these guys which doesn't look like we're going to get anything out of them. They're not highlighted or anything. So no no jobs to do. Figure might as well get all this stuff taken care of. Oh, hello. Get all this stuff taken care of so that once we actually talk to Her Majesty, we can just head out. Ah, uh, the ink has run and the writing is completely ineligible. Okay. Okay... Nope. Garter. Okay. What does that actually do? Oops. I'm taking it either Jade, Veronica, or Serena. 
try it out. It's not... What is it? Oh, accessory. Um, agility goes down a decent amount. Charm. Charm and defense actually goes up a lot. Holy cow. Um, you don't actually have anything, so you could actually. I could just attach it and automatically. 175 for charm, 105 for defense. Yes? Holy cow. Yes, please. Oh, gotta talk to the cow. He was frozen before. No? Oh, do we not talk to you? I'm kind of disappointed, no. Um, where are you? I'm the head of the one of the most storied houses in Snuffleheim. My life is one of, the, of uninterrupted comfort and pleasure. My only worry is uh, what to spend my vast riches on next. Oh boy, okay. I'm just running through your barrels. There we go. Sun, sea, and scandalous swimsuits with some young ladies in bikinis on the cover. It's full of photographs of perky young women in skimpy skimwear bouncing around the pristine white sands of a sunny beach. Oh, good lord. It wouldn't surprise me that this guy has stuff like that. Um, nothing over here. Can I jump this? Yes, I can. I think that's it for the buildings. I mean, we... Oh, we didn't do the stuff over there. Sorry. In the water. Yeah, let's go take a look. Something. I thought so, but well, never mind. It must have just been my imagination. Come on, let's that was go. weird. One of the orbs must be nearby. Must be Her Majesty to honor guests. The Queen awaits you in the throne room at the top of the stairs. Oh, there's a lot to look at here, too. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Can I go in here? A little buddy. Uh, time waits for no man, but we have a plan. It may require a caravan. Uh, the luminary are just indulging in the spot of singing, help with the spirits, let you know, allow me to pass on a password a found. I found. The taco tells Nora the password it's found. With the room of revival via the altar of the undeciphered. Go and speak with the mayor of Tickington and he'll tell you how to use the password I gave you properly. There are a ton of these. We're going to have to go back and take care of those sometime. Oh, I see a book too. Nobleman's Knife? Uh, Crystal Kingdom. Okay. Anything else in here? That knife, though. Whoa! 170, 91, 146? Yes, please. Assassin's Dagger. There we go. Do you have anything you can wear? Bling bling belt. 90, 157 for charm. Yeah, you can wear that. Uh, and, and about... Um, leveling up. So, what we need... Um, we're still a ways away from it. 
but once you get up to a higher level, like into the 40s, like high 30s, 40s, there's a way where you can go from like high 30s, 40, low 40s to level 99 within just a few hours. And some of the stuff you need, like for for me, what I would need is this one down here. No, where is it? I think it's like right here. Um, it, ena it enables me to activate like pep powers easily, like to act e more easily go into it. Uh, for Eric, what you need is an ability up here called I think it's Guile. Is the one he needs? Well, it's it's in the Guile section. But I believe it's this one that you need for him. Which is expensive because I believe that's well, like one of the 20 point ones. And then you also need Jade. And... Oh, we already have it. We already have Thunder Thrust. Which doesn't connect so often, but when it does, it can cause a critical hit. You need that one. So once you have all three of those, um, things with, with Arcel, with the hero, with Jade, and with Eric, it's much easier. It's a really cool trick. And we'll show you once we actually get to that part of the game. Um, we still got a ways to go for that, though. Okay, let's check out this side. Whoa. Interesting. Okay, let's not go down there yet. You fool. Hmm? Hmm? Oh yeah? Well if I'm a fool, then what are you? What's the matter with you, Veronica? I didn't say anything. Yes, you did. Didn't you? Hmm, something funny's going on around here. Let's get in and see the queen before anything else strange happens. I have a feeling it's coming from that book. Interesting. Ah, excellent. You came. Let me present to you the blue orb of Sniffelheim. If you will just come a little closer. Stop! Huh? Huh? from the book please you have to listen to me I am the real Frisabel the woman in front of you is the witch what ridiculous she's the witch not me don't believe her lies hmm trick us once shame on you trick us twice shame on us you might not like being trapped in there again, but you'll just have to get used to it. I think Veronica's, uh, Veronica is quick to judge on this one. I'm not... I'm not too sure. No, you're wrong. The spell didn't work because Snorri paused in the middle of it. You have to believe me. She's lying. The Wicked Witch is trying to trick you again. You have to believe me. Everybody, calm down. I have been Her Majesty's tutor for ten years. If anyone can tell the real queen from the imposter, it is me. I will ask one question to both of you. Whoever answers it correctly is the real Queen Frisabel. Here is the question. What is the true treasure of Sniffelheim? The real Frisabel would remember her father's teachings well. <laughs> That's easy. 
The true treasure of Sniffelheim is clearly the blue ore. What else could it be but something so valuable? Hmm, the orb, you say? Very well, very well. Now then, what is your answer? The true treasure of Sniffelheim is its people. Though the bleakest blizzards assail them, ever do they warm these frigid climes with their ardent hearts. Even they know. Precisely. The very words the royal family have passed down through the generations. The real Queen Frisabel is the one in the book. No! She's a liar, you fools! You imbeciles! Can't you see? Curse you! Oh, yes. Very queenly. Fine. You caught me out again. I surrender. I surrender. <laughs> oh, I wait all that time to get my powers back, and you make me waste every last drop on escaping that wretched book again. My magic is spent. My life is yours. Boil me in a cauldron, burn me at the stake. Just get it over with. Men, take her to the dungeon. Wait! Your Majesty, what are you doing? Why would Her Majesty protect the witch who tried to destroy her kingdom? Could she be under Crystallia's control? Her eyes are clear and lucid, and she seems to be in her right mind. Well, there's only one way to find out. Let us hear what she has to say. Queen Frisabel, please step away from her. She says she has lost her powers, but how can we know for sure? She is a witch. It is in her nature to lie. Everyone, listen to me. It is true that Kristalinda did something unforgivable when she froze this city. But we spoke from time to time when she held me captive. She listened to me. She even helped me to understand what it is to be queen. Hers is not a bad heart. And the time I spent in the book, it gave me the chance to think. To ready myself to truly rule at last. Please, I believe her when she says her powers are spent. She is not a threat to us any longer. We must let her live. Hmm, she seems convinced, Snorri. Why not give Crystalinda one last chance? Like, this is a pretty forgiving thing. Like, she completely frees the whole kingdom. Very well. You are the ruler of this kingdom, your majesty. If that is your decision, we will gladly follow it. <laughs> Must you be so nicey-nicey, Frisabel? You're making me look bad. Crystalinda, there's something I still don't understand. Why did you free Sniffelheim in the first place? Oh, that was a favor for a friend. The splendid specimen who released me from the grimoire. As you know, I was trapped in that dusty, fusty library for a horribly long time. Oh, it was so, so boring. Then, three months ago, he appeared. He took down my book from the shelf and spoke to me. 
I will release you oh. from prison, but you must do something for me in return. For a beautiful boy like you? Anything. Free me and I am yours forevermore. What is your desire, my pretty? You must freeze Sniffleheim. When you do, a great hero will be sent to save the city. One who wears the same pendant as I. Okay. His name is Hendrik. And when he arrives, I would like you to kill him. Kill Hendrik. So I did as he asked. And when the great hero arrived, I decided to have him run a little errand for me before I disposed of him. To slay a mighty beast that just happened to have stolen my powers. And, well, the rest you know. The same pendant as Sir Hendrik, eh? And what was this handsome <laughs> young fellow? This is interesting. I, I don't get... Why? Oh. Oh, I haven't a clue. He disappeared after he freed me, and I haven't seen him since. It's a shame. He was such a pretty little thing. That's interesting. This plot is getting real thick. Thank you once again for all you have done for me and my kingdom. The orb is yours to do with as you see fit. All right, we got the blue arm. Oh, I was going to say something else after that. <laughs> your majesty, isn't the orb one of your kingdom's most precious treasures? Are you sure you don't mind us taking it? Of course. As my father always said, the true treasure of this kingdom is its people. And if not for you, they may well have been frozen forever. Okay. Well, if you insist, best of luck with all your royal duties, and try not to let the pressure get to you, okay? I'm... I'm just a little surprised that Jasper would do oh, this. Oh, don't worry about that, little girl. Free Sabel will be just fine. I plan to take very good care of her. I mean, she's got some good magic on her side now. Some very powerful magic. Destructive. Starts to glow brighter than ever before. Ooh. Nord's orb collection is complete. Head east through the Snarafelt and climb through the first forest to open a path to Yggdrasil. Which is one of the cooler levels in the entire game. It's very pretty. That is going to wrap up this video for today. Um, the story is starting to, uh, get interesting with Jasper being the one to pull the witch out of the book, um, and calling for the death of Hendrik. That's, that's a little insane. So, uh, hopefully figure, figure out a little bit more after that, uh, in the next video. So until then, I will see you guys later. Take care and peace out.